Hi, my name is Nancy. I went to the doctors because uh, I was falling. Uh, my leg would let go. So I went to my, see my doctor and my doctor in turn sent me to a specialist and the specialist said, you've got a herniated disc. It's pushing against the nerve. We've got to take care of it. And they had given me a couple of options like PT or surgery. And I kind of asked which one would be better in my in my case, and they said the fastest way would be to do surgery and get that compression off off that nerve. So my husband was on the phone and I asked him at the same time and he said he would go to surgery and get it done quick and at least this way I'd be relieved of the pain and be able to stop moving again. So I, I agreed to that. I was prayed on uh, probably about a week before my surgery. Uh, they prayed with Lillian, uh, Jen, and Judy prayed over me. And I felt a difference when I was just as calm as calm could be. And now usually I'm a nervous wreck. February 5th came, which was the day of my surgery. I went into the hospital. I was prepped for surgery. I had, they had put the IV in. I had spoken to the anesthesiologist. All of a sudden, the doctor came in, started talking, and he asked me how I was feeling. And I said, I'm feeling pretty good. You know, he says, how's your pain? And I said, eh, probably about a one. And I said, I'm sore in my hip. But, you know, as far as anything else, it's not that bad. And he says, we can do surgery. But he said, if you're feeling that well, he said, I would rather not cut you open and let's try physical therapy instead. It wasn't too long after that, he said, well, you're ready to go. You can go home and, you know, we'll get physical therapy in, involved and you'll be done. So I called my husband and I said, come and get me. He says, what's going on? I said, surgery is canceled. I said, he'd rather not cut me open if he doesn't have to. What did your husband say to that? He said, well, there. He says, okay, <laughs> I'll be there to get you. I walked, out, I walked out of the hospital, got in the car, went and had breakfast, and then went home <laughs> with no cuts. <laughs> it, was kind of, it was kind of funny, you know, the way it happened, but I get out and I said, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> it's the only thing I could think of was, thank you, Lord, you know, for not having me get cut open.